So people are asking me about this uh, headlight, projected headlights. I got them on an eBay for $500, I think, from Thailand or somewhere else. You can also get them on a cruiserparts.net. Um, they vary from 300 to 500 bucks, depends on the quality of them. As far as the quality goes, they are good lights. They're looking really good in the car. As far as the performance is, I'm not really, really uh, like them. Even it has a Xeon light bulb, and I, I use a 55 watt, uh, I think 6,000, uh, 6,000 luminous. And I'm not really pleased with them. The, the 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 reason why I'm not pleased with them so much the the pattern of them kind of kind of bad instead of uh, having that pattern that f f uh, horizontal pattern they this guy has a V shape pattern like 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 this V like like I expect to have horizontal like this and a small niche goes on and goes like that this guy has has a pattern like this okay. So it's like check mark V pattern, and it doesn't matter what I did to them, adjust it. Um, not, not, not so good. Um, as far as you know, I can, I can live with them. The, the angel light that goes around them, right here, and there's three uh, light, uh, what is it called, LEDs. Hey, <laughs> really good. I can show you. How these look like? Hey, you got the point. They really, really stands up. Uh, as far as the light, I'm not really pleased, but you know. Some people just do it for the look. I was thinking. Now, people are asking, oh, let me go back to your car. Let me open the hood. So people are asking, will they fit uh, a Lex 450? This is a Lex 450 96. You can see the Lex assembly. Uh, of course they will. No problem. So, as far as the mounts goes, there's three mounts: one, two, third on the bottom. Because this lights, uh, because this lights um, has uh, blinkers or oh, this is this is not a blinkers. This is uh, oh whatever you know what I'm talking about. The original has two pieces. This is, has one piece. If you install them exactly um, as it is you know the fitment is not uh, so good so what I have to do right here look at look look at look careful right here see I have to put a shim about half an inch once you put the shim right here on both here and there only only here they fit well here and they fit well on the bottom just right here once you put the shim there this part will be more snag to the body if you don't, there's going to be a small gap right here. That's that's the only thing. Now, as far as hooking up everything else, there's no problem. I have a Xeon uh, baluster here and and all the rest of the stuff. So as far as hook up, it's straightforward. And this is comes from from the light. It's from the light. Anyway, biggest piece is this, the radiator grill or radiator. So what I did is I purchased a brand new one from uh, I saw in a uh, eBay 65 bucks or something uh, for the Land Cruiser. It didn't come with a logo, so I took this logo. You look at my logo. I bolted in this logo to the Land Cruiser grill. And the big portion here is the Land Cruiser versus uh, Lexus. Is the Lexus has the grill that goes cuts like like right here, right this way. Land Cruiser this way. So I got this and the fitment as well. Everything fitted extremely well, except I cannot. I can see except the bottom part piece, but that doesn't doesn't mean anything. Uh, now I want to show you my original 
Lexus. And it was installed there too, don't get me wrong, it's it's working. It was working, it was working well. Except uh, I just want to be I'm just kind of perfectioner. So in order to make a Lexus grill fit there, fit those lights, what you need to do is cut right here. Take a look. See this hole right there? So this part, this part, see? needs to be flat. Same thing on that side. It goes like this on the... See how much I cut with the Dremel? Okay. Once you do that, they will cover those lights right here a little bit like this. It can be flat against this. Uh, it will also hold really well, no no gapping, no anything else, just, you know, I am a little bit thick in my hand, so I just purchased the Land Cruiser. I saw a very good deal, brand new, 65 bucks, boom, I'm there, just swap the logo, put a logo there, call it good. So, ev everything is looking, see, really nice. So, if somebody tells you that lights, not a fit, it fit, not exact fit, but we'll fit. That's how it is right now. So I have any questions, ask me. But my advice for you, um, keep the original one, put a Xeon 55 light bulb, 600, 6K, Luminous, um, you'll be better with those that gives more light than this projector lights. Like I said, I'm not really pleased with the projector light. So, and I'm not sure how this thing, how this will last. If they made in China, somewhere else, they may get yellow in about three years. So, I I can't speak for for this poly little whatever that is. Now. Next video I'm gonna do about the uh, supercharger and let's listen to that. Be interesting. See ya.